Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Christine and my hair looks a little crazy today and that's because we are doing another product review. Super excited. Also, my bangs look a little crazy. I have a mirror off to the side for this specific product today and I'm like, oh, my bangs look a little crazy. I'm starting to realize that the hairstylist that cut my hair did not necessarily cut my bangs very even. So we're just gonna ignore that for now. Anyways, so I found this off of Amazon, literally like a clip. It's uh, called, specifically it's called a hair root volumizing clip. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to clip it near the root of your head and then like with either like damp or almost dry hair. And then it's supposed to like make your hair like more volumized. Which, girls out here, if you have naturally straight hair, we were blessed with not volumized hair. That's just, that's what we get when you have straight hair. It's just not volumized unless you do some sort of tips, tricks, or tools. So, we're going to test these out today. It came in a pack of six. Yes, it came in a pack of six. And it was $11.99. So, of course, I tend to buy things that don't have directions. So the only directions I have are based off of what the pictures on Amazon show me. So that is how this is also gonna go. So it says, easy operation, self-modification, self-confidence. And it shows this girl with like really stick straight hair. And then after it shows, she basically has like a blowout. Not really sure if that's actually real, but we're just gonna go for it. Literally, it looks like they're just separating the top parts of their hair, clipping these in with like the thicker point here at the base of their hair, and then taking a blow dryer and blow drying it. It's showing a picture of what not to do and what to do. It's literally like you need to put it as close as possible to your hair and make sure the thick side is down. So with that, let's do this. <laughs> so I have my mirror off to my side. I'm just gonna brush my hair out. As you guys can see, my hair is like somewhat damp, somewhat dry. So I think this is gonna work very well. I have lost all my alligator clips, basically what you use to separate your hair when you're like curling it or anything in the move. I've lost a lot of things. Um, so I'm just gonna separate my hair with a hair tie. So pretty much anybody can do this if you have a hair tie at home. So I'm gonna do this side first. I guess I don't really need to use a hair tie to separate this if I'm starting like at the root. Try to get these bangs out of the way. All right, first section, take my volumizing clip, get to the root, and then, okay. I understand why they give you like multiple ones because I like totally missed this. Okay, well there's one side, I guess. So now I'm gonna do the other side. Uh, is this like a 90s hairstyle or is that just me? Okay, so there it is, my three clips. I know they come in like larger packs. I think they come in like eight and 10 as well. So if three or six isn't enough, which I think if these actually work, I'd probably purchase more because I feel like I could get more volume if I could do more of my head, but they're just, they're not like wide clips. So I have to do it in like kind of smaller sections. So I feel like if these do work, I would purchase more because this I don't feel like is going to be enough to completely volumize my hair. Like if I could get more like under here as well, I think that would work a lot better. But got my handy dandy blow dryer with me. So we're going to see. They do in the picture have like the little flat attachment, but I've had this blow dryer for so long and I've never used that flat attachment that I have no idea where it is. So I'm just going to use it as is and put it on low heat because I was not given any instructions. But tell me, nope, it just shows blow dryer. It doesn't tell me what kind of heat it is. So I'm just gonna do low heat and hope for the best. So 
So I blow dried my hair and it's like really hard to tell whether or not it's dry in the clip. It's just, it just feels like hair. So I'm gonna take these out. After it dried, I let it sit for like five minutes just so like I didn't like take it out. Cause I have like a feeling that these are kind of like the same concept of like curlers. Like when you put curlers in your hair and you get that like nice blowout volume. So I just wanted to let it sit. So I'm going to take out this one first, wait, this one, what, <laughs> oh no, um, okay that one wasn't as bad as the front one, oh no, oh my gosh no, No! <laughs> oh man, this is why I do these things for you guys so that you don't have to waste your money and do this with me. No! <laughs> you guys see this? Oh my gosh! This is freaking hilarious. I mean, I guess you can consider it volumized and more lift in a really... <laughs> sure, it volumized my hair, but it crimped it too! Oh my gosh! So, that was a complete fail. Like, my hair wasn't even that wet. I can't even imagine what it would look like if my hair was actually wet. This was a total fail. I was really excited because like it's such a cute color, it's a clip, it's super easy, and it did not do what it in <laughs> advertised to do. Then again, I said the advertisement basically took a girl with flat straight hair and then showed you her with a blowout. So I'm not entirely surprised that this failed because their ad seemed very suspicious, but like, I did not think it was gonna do this. Review time. Don't waste your freaking money. These are glorified alligator clips at this point, and that's what they'll be used for now. They will be used for me parting my hair for when I need to curl it. So, no, don't waste your money. These are not worth it. They do not work. With that, it has been two weeks since I started my giveaway and I decided I am going to announce live on Instagram and I'll also save it to my story. So I will announce it live on Instagram when this video is uploaded so you guys can exactly see me putting everybody's names into a hat and drawing it out so it doesn't look like I am favoring anybody or if it's rigged or anything, I really don't want my subscribers to lose their faith in me over just one giveaway. So I am going to pull a winner live on Instagram. I will also attach it to my story just in case you missed the live. So go check that out if you want to see whether or not you win those free AirPods. With that, I am going to go fix this disaster. I just fixed my hair and now it's not crimpy. I just wanted to come in and put this little snippet in because after I filmed, my fiance came in, saw my hair and was like, what did you do? And I was like, well, I just filmed the video and the product was a fail. And he was like, well, did you look it up to see if you did it right? And I was like, yeah, I did. After I stopped filming, I looked up to see if any other YouTubers had done it and they had, and most of them didn't get any results at all. They didn't have the crimp like I did, lucky for them. But yes, that product was an absolute fail, just in case you were wondering. So I just wanted to put that in there that I did look it up. I didn't do it wrong. It's just not a good product. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button for me. And if you wanna know when my next videos are posting, hit that notification bell. If you wanna see more fails like this or more awesome hair products like my Waveformers video, if you haven't seen that, highly recommend you go check that out. Thank you guys for watching this fail today and I hope you laughed as much as I did. Bye!